Hey, good morning. What's up, YouTube? This morning, we have training. Before I get into that, today's the first day of the MLR 2023 season. And, um, just waking up. So, January 9th. I got off last night around like 8, so... Spent a little time with the family and just doing a little bit of study for our set plays and pieces that we're going to go over today. I'm just want to get that down before I head out over there. And, um, coach asked me a question, you know, I'll be ready to answer. But other than that, um, super excited. Um, just going to make videos to start this journey of what it's like to be, you know, an MLR player. In the U.S., you know, so stay tuned. All right, y'all. I just pulled up to the uh, facility that we train at. It's over there. Look at this. What I see every day when I'm coming here. All right, what's up, YouTube? Um, practice just finished. Practice. We just finished our gym session. Um, now we're about to uh, all head over to the field. I have class at 12.30, and then gonna hit the field. Just finished training. About to go up and grab my kit. You know, a little bit of conditioning. It's so bad. But it's only gonna get better. It was a little tough, but uh, I was able to get it done. Nice stuff. Yes, sir. Mm. Currently raining right now. Uh, Try to get out of here. Go see the wife and kids. You know, that was pretty much a day in the life almost. I'll get more, obviously, more in depth as the year goes on. Um, but you know, this is the first couple weeks, so gotta stay tuned in to, you know, what we're running. Can't really muck around. Um, you know, we all, you know, as a job, so gotta keep the professionalism for what it is. Uh, other than that, I'll see y'all at the house. I just got this new kid that just came in. It's uh, Jenny and Kevin for uh, all the kit. I'm just gonna take y'all through it. Kinda went through a quick day through a day of the life of an MLR player. Um, you know, went to practice, had the gym session, then came home, spent time with the family, try to find that balance between, you know, work and spending time with my kids, time to switch off and, but yeah, no, let's just go straight into the kit, you know, cause, man. One of the, the best parts of being in Milan, you know, get to be a pro athlete and, you know, you get a bunch of free gear, you know. But yeah, typical, you know, training shirts. You know, I like these. We always wear these. 
<clears throat> I bet all my cousins is gonna hit me up. You know, first come, first serve. You know, <laughs> what we got here? We got the uh, oh, the bigger sweaters. Nice and waterproof. Also sponsored by, if you haven't seen Paladin, huge sponsor here in the U.S., which is really good. Love the game of rugby. Welcome to the Sea Wolves on the Hunt Packet. Oh snap! Not the hoodie. Let's go. It's really cold in Seattle, so we we really always wear these things. This one, unless they look good. Look at that. Rain jacket to go with it. Ooh. So, if you guys don't know, a sea wolf is basically an orca. It's a killer whale. A ruthless one, too. Like us. But, uh, yeah. These are flawed, man. Got the new design on the side. Got this MLR seal on it. That's cool. Oh, this is fly. So, these are our tank tops to train in, you know, usually on Tuesdays. Tank top Tuesdays, everybody call it. If you don't come in these, you get fined, pretty much. You get to like spin the wheel or something. You get like a punishment, or you can pay yourself out. But it'll cost you some cash. I spun the wheel a few times. I just paid the cash because I didn't want to do it. But yeah, it's this. Not the polo. Yeah, these are clean. Got the polo shirt, you know, for when we go to events and sponsoring and helping out at camps. We also do a lot of rugby camps, so we all want to be matching with the same thing, especially when we travel. Um, it's huge that you, we're all wearing the same thing. You know, uniform, look united, look fresh, play fresh. For some reason, we just went all black this year with the kit. So here's our black Sea Wolves rugby shorts. Yeah, these are clean. Everybody was wearing these today. I couldn't because I just got mine. But man, everybody look fresh. I'm about to rock these probably tomorrow. Yep. Got the shorts in. I don't know about these shorts. You know, I'm really in love with the last year's shorts, so. We'll see what they're about. We've got, ooh, see, I wore the, I wore this today at training. The t-shirt, man, the t-shirts go hard. We almost felt like the Warriors out there, barbarians or something. Yeah, no, these go hard. The all blacks. Ooh, we always get some type of you know fancy jersey to go with it so here it is let's go Ooh, this is clean sign these hand it down hey man the first person to subscribe to this video i'll send you this i'll send you this jersey right here Yeah, other than that, um, just a brief overview of what my main goal is here. Um, basically, just trying to give you guys the opportunity to see somebody who is in MLR if you ever plan on playing rugby or are playing rugby and you always wonder what it's like to be in the day of a player in MLR. Well, this is it. I'm going to have a channel pretty much for strictly rugby and, you know, the game is only going to grow. There are a lot of players out there with huge potential, you know, to be great rugby players. Obviously, uh, rugby is new in the United States. It's only been around for um, five years. So that being said, from this point on, it's only gonna get bigger. We got um, college teams with um, rugby teams. We have club teams all over the US. Basically, I play for the Seattle Sea Wolves. I play center um, and winger. Um, I've been playing rugby for a while now. I grew up in Portland, Oregon. Um, and I played for a 
club called the East Side Tsunami. I picked up by the Seattle Seawolves in a sevens tournament. So I went over there and gave it a try out and um, got selected. Alan Clark, he's our head coach from West Pate. They spoke to me after and decided to give me a shot. And um, here I am, played last year. Made the 23 a few times, uh, which is huge when there's 40 guys trying to make the same squad. Other than that, yeah, nothing new. Just excited for the journey. You know, I love to work hard and, and grind and, um, you know, let the world know what I got. But, um, with that being said, you know, stay tuned. You know, I'll catch you guys at the end of the week on Friday. Peace.